Hey, what's up guys? Sprout, I'm back with another video and today we're doing something a little bit different. We are going to have some Pokemon to open up, but I did, well I'm going to be opening up 17 of these NHL packs that I got from Tim Hortons. Tim Hortons is a coffee shop in Canada. Every Canadian loves their Tim Hortons and sometimes, I think it's like a yearly thing where we get uh, hockey packs. I try to collect this set every year. This year it came out... Um, I guess, and yeah, it came out a couple days ago, but last year I didn't have a channel yet to open them up on, so I thought, hey, why not open up on the channel and see what we pull. Uh, I don't know if you guys like hockey cards or not. I love them, so hopefully uh, other people can enjoy this video too, see what we get, and I'm going to open up some Ultra Prism at the end. I got some Ultra Prism packs, and we'll see how far into the video we are. We might open up some Vivid Voltage. All right, let's do this. All right, so I think there's three cards in each pack. Um, let's see what we can get. All right, what do we got? Jordan Binnington. We got Patrick Kane, nice. And Frederick Anderson, Toronto Maple Leafs. That's awesome. All right, put those over there. I'm so used to it being on the other side of the flap. Because of Pokemon. <laughs> Alright. So, I guess the main card we probably want is Crosby. There's another Frederick Anderson. Nice! And... Who's that? Brandon Point. He's good. Valis... Valley. Why can't I say his name? I know it too. Andre Valis... Valisky, whatever his name is. He's a good goalie for Tampa Bay. They just won the cup this year, didn't they? Yeah, it was Tampa Bay that won it. So they got their first cup. Steve Stamkos finally got his cup. It's pretty awesome. I didn't really watch, because um, there's no fans in the arena. I couldn't really get into the sports. It's so different. There's Joe Thornton. Oh, nice cup winning. Sidney Crosby, Pittsburgh Penguins, and Kyle Connor. That's nice to put you back there. I love Crosby. I know a lot of people don't like Crosby, but I do. He's one of my favorite players. Him and Pittsburgh Penguins is my favorite team. Um, again, I like Melkin. Like those two together, just they're, they're amazing. I'm from Ottawa, so Senators is the team I'm supposed to be cheering from. If you cheer for your home, uh, there's an Ottawa player actually, Thomas Shafat. But the Senators suck. I find they don't know how to build a team at all. Like they trade all their, yeah, they trade away all their good players. Ottawa, like Ottawa if, sucks. If you actually take a look at the players they end up trading away, they either become captains or assistant captains or like one of the top highest paid players on the other team that they traded them to. There's another Stanley Cup one, gets left. Nice. Just because we live and in Ottawa doesn't mean we like Ottawa. <laughs> actually, this one here, uh, this 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 hits hard at home. Um, they beat Ottawa Senators for the cup that year. The Ducks. Oh, they did. Yeah. They made it all the way to the Stanley Cup final, and they lost to the Ducks back in 2006 or yeah. six or yeah six or seven. I think it was 2007. I think it was a great 11. All right, Mark. Is that a checklist? Feels different. Feels like paper. It's so weird. That's cool. But let me know if you guys like these kind of videos. Like I always seek, I have tons of sports cards. Um, I don't really buy packs anymore, but I see them all the time. I'm so tempted to buy them, especially these new ones at Walmart. There's some ones that are like guaranteed to have a graded card in it. And I look at them all the time and it's just like, oh, do I want to grab them? But then that money could be spent on Pokemon videos. So there's another Cindy Crosby one. And Carl Eric Carlson, he's awesome. I hated when Ottawa traded him away. It's like, no, what are you doing? You trade him away, like when you're bet. But I think he asked to leave, so that's why we got rid of him. I understand when Daniel out Al Alfredson left because uh, he wanted to win a cup. PK Subban, he's good too. And then Kerry Hart, this card's kind of cool. So there's like a bunch of different like subsets, I think so, uh, inside the, um, inside these packs. Like this is the main set, this is what the cards would look like. And then you'd get 
Uh, how many is in this one? See. Well, it just says this is number one. What number is this one? Number nine. I have to get the checklist. But there's like different ones, like different kinds of uh, cards in the set. Like this will be another different kind that you can get. Chris Weber, he's awesome. We got a Phantom. Ooh, check out that. That's so cool. It's, uh, Jeff Carter is good too. That's a nice card. This card's are probably not gonna be worth anything. Well, especially right now. Maybe in the future. Um, I remember my dad has tons of nice hockey cards. Like I got an autograph Patrick Wall. Uh, we got the. Uh, I think it's a rookie card too. An autograph Patrick Wall rookie card. We got um, Gordy Howe autograph card, and it's inside a plaque that has his name on it. I got Chris Phillips autograph. And there's Ben Bishop. We got a bunch of cool cards. Patchqua was my favorite goalie growing up. I played hockey pretty much my whole life. I wanted to be a goalie, but changed my mind, and I finally uh, was old enough to play. I was like, nah, I don't. I want to go score goals. Nice, Brad Marchand. I don't like Boston at all. And Ovechkin, nice. Ov. When he won the cup, it was so funny just watching his antics all over TV. Like, he was partying so hard with that cup. There's another one of these. Jack Eckle. He's so good. And then Kurt Hurt. Uh, when he broke his leg there in his first season, that was so sad to watch. Oh, Connor McDavid, he's amazing. There's another Connor McDavid. Two in one pack, nice. He's another one of uh, my favorite players right now. My all-time favorite team growing up was Detroit Red Wings. I love the team that had, uh, stand out, it's cool, that had uh, Iserman, Fedorov, Shanahan, Chilios, Lindstrom. That was a team. I got Chris Osgood in net, and then they got Cujo. It, that was crazy back then when I was a kid. I always picked Detroit playing on the NHL games. I still play my hockey game, but I'm in Pittsburgh now. I'm try I'm getting NHL NHL 21 for Christmas. I was gonna buy it pretty much right away when it came out. I actually didn't even realize it came out when it did. Just so much stuff going on. There's another Stanley Cup one, and another Connor McDavid. But um, yeah, I know it's out now. I'm, so expensive games, it's crazy. Seventy nine ninety nine, like it's crazy. I thought when they were, it used to come out for like PS one, PS two, fifty nine ninety nine was expensive. Now it's seventy nine ninety nine. It's crazy. And uh, the limited edition's over a hundred dollars for the, the NHL game. We saw it yesterday at Walmart actually. Nicholas Backstrom. I just put those ones back there just because they just have holding the Stanley Cup and yeah, it's cool. All right, this is the last hockey pack. And we still haven't pulled a Crosby. Well, we pulled the other Crosby, but not the main one. Carey Price, nice. He's an amazing goalie. All right, we're seven minutes into the video. Or ten, ten minutes? What is that? No, seven something. Might not have to edit much in this. That's awesome. We'll see what happens. All right. So, Ultra Prism, amazing set, probably one of the best on the moon sets. Well, not probably, it is one of the best on the moon sets. Um, we want the gold Lunala. What is the card that we want in here? I can't remember. <laughs> Why can't I remember? John Blank. I think it's gold cards, the two gold Lunala and uh, Sogaleo. I believe that's the cards you want out of here. All right, Evie, Salandid, Church Wig. Ooh, that's a nice looking card. And is that a hollow? No, it's not. Toxic Croak. Alright, going to the next one. We got these four packs at the or is it, comic book store. I went in to see if they had anything cool. They didn't really have much, but I saw they had Ultra Prism packs. And they're getting harder to find for sure. There's three packs that Walmart had, those boxes. I can't find any more of those at all. Electric 
Popeyes, Frost Romp, and Drapion non hollow. Leafy on pack. Code card. Three, four. All right. Unidentified fossil, Cherum, Goom Shop, Piplup. Snover, Murkrow, Gilbo, Magneton, and <laughs> we just got you in reverse. Alright, last pack. Come on. Hopefully he gave me some packs. I don't get to pick the packs. The guy hands them to me. Hopefully he gave me something. Oh, I just tripped out. I saw the fairy energy thinking that there's only like, wizard fairy energy doing in here because I've been opening a lot of uh, sword shield air packs and they don't have them. So it just tripped me out a little bit. And we got nothing. Wow, that sucks. All right. Let me see. All right. We can open this guy up. Hope we can pull something better. This is one of the vivid voltage. Um, uh, three packs. So let's see what we get. There's the coin. Code card, guys. And the promo is Vaporeon. I wanted both of the the two different ones, because there's uh, two different three packs, but I couldn't find uh, the other promo. I don't even remember which one it is. I think it's Subble crying. Yeah, I believe it's Subble. He's like crying because he didn't get any berries. <laughs> All right, three, four. Let's go. We got Bay, D Watt. C dot, Fanfi, Shuppet, Fortress. So nothing in that one. Two packs left. Celebi, it's my favorite packer. Four to the front, we'll go fighting energy. Ah. Exadrill, Noah's Leaf, Opel, Fabapus, Electric, Execute, EV, Woobats, the reverse is Matane, and we got a hollow Zapdos. Nice, at least we got a hollow this time. Alright. Last pack magic. Come on. Water to the front, we'll go water. Uh, extra drill again. All right, let's take the same pack. Come on, Dreadnought, and oh, yes, we got something. Or Beetle V Max. That is awesome. Oh, the Orbital V box actually comes out on Friday, which is tomorrow. I'm going to be picking it up and open it up on the channel, so stay tuned for that. Man, this is a nice card. Thanks for reminding me, Orbital, that your box is coming out tomorrow. <laughs> All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Definitely leave a like. Let me know about the hockey cards if you like seeing stuff like that. I definitely could open more up. If not, it's cool. I'll stick to Pokemon. I want to get into Yu-Gi-Oh! too again. I only opened a little bit of Yu-Gi-Oh! because of Toon Chaos. I thought it was such an amazing set. And I saw the new set there. Um, Mighty and Gold. I can't remember what it's called offhand. Like, But uh, it's a really cool set. I definitely would like to open some of them up. Even that uh, the new Raw set with the, uh, the Ghost Rare Raw. I would like to open that up too. So, I don't know. Let me know, guys, what you think. And leave a like for the video. And sub if you haven't. We're on the road to 1,000 subs. Alright, guys. See you in the next one. Bye. Peace.